Hello everybody and welcome to our brand new shiny special super awesome gator stream. Today we have a very special guest and your name is? It's Pi. Wee! <laughs> see which of my terrible outfits should I wear? <laughs> <laughs> Chaotic child Pi. <laughs> Do you like my outfit? You look fabulous. This is my ghost outfit. <laughs> Do I look pretty? Sneakle. <laughs> um, I want to surprise my girlfriend because her wife is Hatsune Miku, so I want to send her a picture of me with this outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Brandy, like it's the 90s. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> oh, I yeah. have the best outfits. You have a wand. I don't have a wand yet. Yeah. You don't have a wand? I'll have to give you one because I have like 20. <laughs> Pajamas. The problem is that if you have a <laughs> outfit on, <laughs> if you have an outfit on, then you can't change your clothes without removing it, and it really is frustrating. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there. There we go. <laughs> I sneeze on you. I sneeze on you. Sneeze on you. you. <laughs> Alright, so... <laughs> here's the... Waterfall. Here's a quick little tour of my island, uh, Bunnyum. So... Uh, where to start? Where to start? Let's go this way. So... It's not quite finished yet, and it's not real that fancy. It's still a three-star island, um, but um, hopefully it's decent enough. Looks uh, nice. I like the road. Oh, thank you. Um, up here is my latest edition. So uh, this started off as a bit of a viewing platform, but actually has a bit of a second uh, purpose that I kind of figured out today. Ooh, it's pretty. Thank you. Um, so it's a viewing platform for my restaurant down there. But I've also kind oh, of well. figured that this might also be like a nice little conference area for the dev team. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Because like we can have like the designers over here, the programmers here, and I can sit here and boss everybody around. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Does this spin? That spins? It's a sushi table. The middle... <laughs> Don't spread the virus. Here, I'll put on my mask. Only my hippie outfit has a mask. <laughs> <laughs> it's Max the Hula Dancer on the head. The Hula Dancer has so much to live for. But not anymore. <laughs> I'll catch you with my butterfly night. <laughs> no, my fish. Here, the fish is away. Scare it away. No. Scare it away. SpongeBob! Run, run! Stop. You can't. Blah, blah, blah. Words. You can't speak. Get over here, fishy, so I can scare you. There. <laughs> and over here is one thing that I'm particularly proud of. This is a little restaurant that I worked on. Spaghetti. It's got, it's got some spaghetti. It's got a stovetop thingy. Um, it's got accessible seating because that's important. And there's a fountain yes. up here. Yes, it's beautiful. Nom 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 nom. So that's pretty much all the developed areas this town, except for this little shopping center I have over here. Um, I put these two popcorn things right here because the way the handlebars look, it kind of looks like they're dancing from a distance. Cool. And of course, there's the giant teddy bear of awesomeness. <laughs> I'm snooping in the house. I don't know whose house it is, but I'm snooping. Mm -hmm. The one villager who's my absolute favorite in Animal Crossing is CC. She's not in this game because she was an amiibo character from the first one they got from Kelly. But the, I know. But the Splatoon amiibos don't work in this game, and it makes me so sad. Neither do the Sanrio ones, and I want Toby so much. Yes, I need Hello Kitty in my, Spl in my Animal Crossing. I'm gonna snoop in your house now. 
I can give you a tour if you want. Snoopy, snoop, snoop, snoop. <laughs> Snooping in your cabinet. <laughs> so I'm going to give a quick tour of my house to the lovely people at home. So this here is my living area thingy. There's a kitchen right here and um, a dining table area. And a little laptop right there just for fun. Off to the side over here. There's a little fishy sanctuary area. These are mostly my, like my favorite ones and things like that. Um, if I catch another <laughs> shark, I definitely want to have that in there. <laughs> Did you turn on my switch? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is the bedroom area. Um, I got posters of here of the waifus and um, Link's Awakening stuff on the higher area. Got a train right here because I love trains. Got some boss from Tokyo MR Assassins right here. And, um, so that reminds me. So one time I accidentally started a stream on Animal Crossing. I forgot to turn the game off. And so one of my friends, James Rolls, saw the Tsubasa thing on the floor. And he was all like, Gator, put away your body pillows before you start streaming. <laughs> right, over here is a little gym area that I'm working on. Um, I definitely want to change the wallpaper because it's kind of gross. So definitely want to change that. So I probably could work out right now, but probably not the best idea to be running on a treadmill in a dress and knee high socks. So probably not the best <laughs> idea. <laughs> It'll certainly be a workout. <laughs> and up here is my favorite place. So this is like a little office area that I've made. Right here is a little typewriter where I can work on books and things like that. And then over here is my recording studio where I can record Let's Plays. Got a computer over here doing it all together. Got posters for Let's Play projects. Like from left to right, there's Nintendo Land. Um, Tomb Raider Underworld, Limbo and Portal, Splatoon Tomb Raider's Master 3D, and Breath of the Wild. Um, over here is the cover art for The Thunder on the Mountain and Yeti Man, which, by the way, fun fact, um, Gaming with Pi was actually the one who did the cover art for Yeti Man, so that's really exciting. <laughs> I did. And I also have, like, a little kitty over here, because every video game nerd needs a kitty. Shut yeah. Uh, downstairs is really not much to show. Um, this is mostly just where I stash my turnips, which, by the way, my turnip prices, they always suck. And sorry, I didn't mean to walk in on you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that's basically my island. It's still a work in progress, but... <laughs> um, the thing is, when it comes to this game, is that I get into a mindset where... I want to keep working on it, but I'm also, like, completely content with how the island looks right now. And, like, you don't want anything to change. Ah! <laughs> I will trap you. Oh, no. <laughs> Chaotic child at work. You done? How much stuff are you burying? <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> <laughs> I'd bury this beetle I have in my inventory if it let me. <laughs> I'm just in the bathroom burying more things. <laughs> Gather around, people, as I tell you about the ghost of Buenayam. <laughs> they came into the night and started burying stuff. Legends say, mm -hmm. to this day, you can still see them in the distance, burying everything in sight. One time my friend had a swap shop on her island, so I just buried everything. <laughs> in the swap shop. Like where it was in the shop, but now it was buried. <laughs> My inventory's empty of things I can bury. Oh wait, no. Wait, that was a fossil. You didn't bury that one. <laughs> wait, no.
no, I didn't bury that fossil. <laughs> There's a different fossil that I did. <laughs> you know, this game of hide and seek is kind of unfair because you can see the stream, so you'll know when I'm coming. I mean, I'm not hiding in a very fair spot either. <laughs> okay, I can't find you anywhere. I'm in the airport. <laughs> oh! No! <laughs> Traitor! <laughs> Um, right. I almost forgot the most important part of the island. I have Marina on my town flag. <laughs> Bye, thanks for coming to the island. Bye. Pi is going home. Safe travels. No, unsafe travels. <laughs> Crash into the ocean. <laughs> like, lost. Yeah, right, so it's been a little lost. Awesome. Yay, fishy! <laughs> This is your wand. Aw, thank you. Mm -hmm. I don't know why all my villagers are at the plaza. Aw, this is adorable. Hey, yeah! <laughs> Did I scare you? My bad. Sometimes oh. I get a little too pumped up and then I get a little bit too loud. You're here visiting, right? That's so cool. My name's Genji. I'm kind of new here, but I'd love to have an off island work buddy. My, this is suspicious. This little red splotch. I'm sure it's just ketchup. Yeah, yeah, it's just ketchup. It's fine. <laughs> this is where Genji lives. Uh, down here is more trees for some reason. Uh, yeah, this is the beach. <laughs> mm, nothing worrisome <laughs> over here. Uh, this is the graveyard. <laughs> it's got a skull. Because, you know, graveyards have skulls out, normally. <laughs> hey, that's where I left that. Yeah, this is for children to play. Yay! Can I be a children? Maybe. <laughs> this is, uh... I don't know how to explain this. It's... <laughs> It's like uh, when you go camping and your parents are all like, you don't need TV. This is your TV. By the way, I like how your kid playground area is not that far away from the graveyard. Uh, yeah, about that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's go this way now. Oh, there's more flowers up there I need to dig up. Again, nothing suspicious over here or anything like that. No. This is my... A uh, goat thing. I'm gonna put a statue up there as soon as I find it. I'm looking for one of the statues of David, I think. Mm -hmm. This up here is a small grave. Got a gong. I really like how you did the terraforming around here. Thank ya. There's my, uh, friend. <laughs> I'm gonna go say hi to them. <laughs> hi. <laughs> Don't sneeze on him. <laughs> He's got injuries. This is the barrel of radioactive waste. <laughs> <laughs> this is a little place where you can play Go. <laughs> Whee! Normal place for this. Uh, this is the graveyard. How many graveyards do you have? That's... <laughs> 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 uh, yeah. <laughs> That's perfectly awesome. <laughs> this is my cat. <laughs> Every graveyard this is my blood. church pew. This is the doll playing a drum. <laughs> uh, then this area down there. I'm not going to go down there yet. But that area is a little shrine thing. And over here is a fairy circle. Ooh. Don't go in the fairy circle. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's how the fairies get you. This is Coco's house. This is the phone booth. 
as usual. There's a natural ketchup stain there naturally. Yeah, yeah. That's actually a full metal alchemist re reference. Over here is the private beach. A very private spot for um, definitely legal things. Mm -hmm. I totally believe you. This is a perfectly normal place to have a picnic. Totally normal. <laughs> yeah. Uh, up here is shopping and Rattle's house. You have so many money trees around. I never shake them. <laughs> they always spawn in the same place, right in the middle of the fairy circle. <laughs> I'm not even joking about that one. It's every single day. I know exactly where the money tree will be. It's in the middle of the fairy circle. Now, you know, fairies, they have to earn an income as well. This is Zucker's house. This is Dom's house. Ooh. Dom is big. This is the children's playground. <laughs> it's kind of on fire. <laughs> Ignore the gasoline and the uh, watch out that's written in ketchup. <laughs> this is Alice's house. This is Rodeo's house. This is a little place you can sit for some reason. Mm -hmm. This is a totally normal book, definitely not a book on murder or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Over here is another one of my friends. Aw, he seems happy. Why is everything on fire in this area? Um... Because. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? This is the moon. <laughs> this is the old well. You probably shouldn't fall in there. Uh, this is a hole for some reason that I didn't dig up. It's a fossil. Okay. This is another one of my friends. He's got a kettle here. He's Boiling, um, potatoes, not children. Oh, <laughs> but the potatoes are innocent. <laughs> <laughs> this way is Lucky's house. Lucky's dead, which is fine. We don't discriminate. This is the little shrine area. <laughs> He's dead, that's fine, we don't discriminate. <laughs> <laughs> Up here is... A little pathway that goes over a waterfall. I like this area. Ooh. And then here is one of the only areas I've never really changed since I first put it in. This is my graveyard. For those keeping track at home, this is the fourth one. Or third. <laughs> no, fourth. <laughs> uh, then over here, yeah, it's kind of a weird way to get there. You gotta jump there and then jump here. Hmm. And then jump here. This is where Muffy lives, and apparently CJ. <laughs> yeah, it, nice it's a perfectly heart. normal house. <laughs> this is my pond. Mm -hmm. It's just a normal pond. Up there is Godzilla. Godzilla. Here's a dolly. Oh, you got little sprinklers up here. Yeah, those are showers to cleanse you off. <laughs> Over here is my graveyard. Oh, there's a fossil in the graveyard again. Yeah, wasp over there. I do. Mm. Uh, I'm not surprised. <laughs> this island's haunted. <laughs> yes, yeah, so this is my graveyard. And then if you go over here and catch this stupid wisp thing, uh, there's a single grave over there, so I don't think that counts as his entire graveyard. But if you come down here... This is my graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> if you come over here, this is the graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> this is the human transmutation circle. <laughs> There's some fire up on that hill. <laughs> <laughs> and a centipede. You know, normal things. <laughs> This is the library, this is the telephone pole, and that's the bonfire. Hmm. 
This is the dog house. There's a little dog in it. See, it's eyes flow. Aww. I want to pet uh, it. It'll probably bite you. Mm. Down here is this beach that you can't get to because there's a bonfire in the way. Mm. Well, there's a message in a bottle. Uh, up here is my Dom shrine. No. The cake is for Dom. Mm. These are his followers. Mm. Followers of the religion of Dom. <laughs> this is an axe for those who um, speak ill of the cult of Dom. Yeah. Up there is like a weird pawn thing that I never go to. And there's Cherry. I don't know what she's doing. Uh, there's Wisp, and this right here is my my personal grave. No, oh, you have your own gravestone picked out. This is my cat. My other one. This is my house. Do I dare go inside after what happened last time? This is my main room. It's my hoarding room. If you turn your camera, you'll notice that you get sprayed with showers as soon as you walk in. For some reason, you can't see it unless you turn the camera, though. So are these cleansing arsons, or is it like torture or cleansing? Uh, both. This is where you can sit at the couch and watch the two TVs while getting sprayed with water. <laughs> uh, let's see. This room back here is my bedroom. One thing you definitely have to applaud Kega Slider for is he definitely has a very good variety of music. Yeah. This bucket in the corner is the toilet, and this is the toilet paper. <laughs> you guys are this is my fish. <laughs> this is the sitting room. This is color coordinated, so this room is red. That couch got moved, and I don't remember moving it. <laughs> but that's fine. The whole place is haunted anyway. Then over here is uh, the tea room slash kitchen. Are the... is a tea made out of potatoes too? Uh, no. <laughs> it's made out of children's tears. Ah. I mean, it's made out of uh, jasmine and rose petals. Aww, children's tears <laughs> is my favorite tea. Then there's the attic. Which is kind of boring because I tried to recreate my real life room in it and then realized that my room is actually in fact very small. Yeah, so that's tiny and then the rest of the space isn't used at all. <laughs> uh, and now for the most important part of the house. <laughs> yeah, this is the basement. <laughs> oh, this, this is very different from last time I saw it. I use it for turnip storage, <laughs> uh, but so I haven't redecorated it in a while. But there is a mirror there because I needed a mirror. Mm -hmm. uh, so we've got the security cameras and the shower. Uh, over here we have kitchen knife, which are not for uh, torture. <laughs> these are more tools that are not for torture, definitely. As well as these random switches. Nobody knows what they do. Probably torture. <laughs> um, there were, I think there was this one video where uh, this one guy was uh, showing off for Island. I think if I could find that video somewhere, I think that shows the original torture chamber. <laughs> I'm sorry, these turtles are instrumental to the torture process. Oh, they're Kappas. They drown children. Ah. Can't it just be outside and torture people? No, oh, no, come in, come in. He has a very fun catchphrase. <laughs> oh, new face. Are you visiting from another island? My name's Don. You're Lady Gary, do you? Cool. I just moved here a little while ago, so I'm still figuring out all the best boaters to lift. Furious. <laughs> hey, cool boaters, let me know about them next time you're <laughs> Um, he also says poggers, and that's like his secret greeting. I like how this really adorable sheep-like thing is the one who says, <laughs> fear us. 
I wish I named my island fun better because pastry is not the most creepy of names, but I name everything pastry, so. <laughs> I don't know if you noticed, but there's a little sign by the airport that's the recent Cyrus's little wedding announcement, and I put a custom pattern over the top of it. <laughs> this is what it looks like when you have all of the fossils. The amount of detail in the models for the skeletons, it's really impressive. Yeah. I like the little dot you stand on. I never got to use it, though, until just recently, because my Joy-Con drift wouldn't let me stand in one place. <laughs> <laughs> but you got that fixed, right? Mm-hmm, I got new Joy-Cons. Yeah. And I'm sending the broken ones in to get fixed soon. I gotta do that for mine, too, because my yellow ones, those ones were my favorite. And they're drifting really badly right now. Oof. But luckily, I have my gray ones, and they still work really well. That's good. This one Mine I, right now are dark blue and yellow. This one in here is probably my favorite. The human? The reindeer thing. Uh, yeah, yeah. Megalos. Megaloceros. The mammoth is also pretty cool, too. I like it when the mammoth villager... That one person who had the mammoth villager in there town was looking at the mammoth uh, skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> I find that to be funny. Yeah. Plesiosaurus. That's probably my favorite. Which one? The Pleosaur. Oh yeah, this one's really cool. It's got like a really long neck. <laughs> mm-hmm. Nessie. I really like your island. It's just so cool, and there's just so much incredible detail in it. Thank you. All right, so uh, do I have a thing? Ha ha! Yes, I do. So before we leave, um, I was thinking we could do one of those timer fishing mini game things. Oh sure, right. I'll scare all the fish away for you. <laughs> oh nice! Uh, you know. Twice as many. <laughs> I think I actually have a villager outfit that makes me look like Dorcroft. <laughs> I do I have any custom design outfits? Oh, I have this one. I can't wear wear it while transform. That's the thing about the wands is that if you're wearing a wand outfit, can't do anything else until you take off the wand outfit. I have this one. It's it's got a little bit of ketchup on it. <laughs> you know, I'm a mess, messy eater. And then I have this one. And the rest of them are actually pretty normal. I have this one that my friend Apple made. And then I have this one that my friend Space Dust made. Nice. Uh, the one I'm wearing right now is the only one that I ever custom made myself. <laughs> this is... Based off Lara Croft's legend outfit. Um, what else do I have? I have that Tsunamiku one I showed you a moment ago. I got Midna from Twilight Princess. Ooh. Joker from Persona. Uh, Shulk from Xenoblade Chronicles, one of the best games ever. Nice. Um, Twilight Princess Zelda. Zelda. <laughs> uh, I also got some. Uh, Roman from Ruby and Neo from Ruby. Yeah, thanks for um, doing this uh, stream and stuff. Thanks for having me. It was super fun. So, thank you, lovely people, for joining us on Animal Crossing New Horizons, and thank you for joining us today, uh, Gimme with Pie. Thanks for having me. <laughs> thank you all so much for watching us, and until next time, Lady Gear to you.